Hi, my sweet cookies of the internet and welcome to a new video. Are you done with the basic dress code of your school? You'd rather disappear into the library and read all day? Well, good thing you intentionally clicked on this video full of amazing dark academia outfit ideas to immerse yourself in the world of studying until you can only survive on coffee or tea with whiskey. And all for the price of a piece of paper and young adult insecurities. The first outfit radiates witchy vibes, like I'm your local tarot reader in a cozy farmer's village in the middle of nowhere. Sounds like a good description of where I live though. The color combination of purple and black are perfect for the Halloween season. Dark academia is all about formality, in my opinion. And what's more formal than a long grey woolen skirt and a grey blazer? The white blouse is a bit alternative from a regular casual white blouse, and I think it fits this lookbook very well. Personally, I wouldn't wear an outfit like this, as I've lately started to like wearing more colors in my outfits so this means that in future lookbooks you're probably gonna see my own style change and I really look forward to sharing that with you my favorite fall combination is a big oversized sweater and a skirt. And no skirt fits this lookbook more than a real schoolgirl's skirt that I bought on a trip to the UK for no good reason other than that I secretly have always loved clothing but just didn't know how to dress nicely. This is a more casual fit but still looks very dark academia. It's just more for the comfy bookworms who just want to snuggle and drink tea. This next outfit screams more cottagecore to me than dark or light academia, but I still think it fits the dress code. Both the orange sweater and the white maxi skirt are thrifted. The sweater is perfect for fall season and again, don't be afraid to mix sweaters with skirts, any kind of skirt, because in my opinion it can look really cute. Then we've got a very casual look consisting of some wine purple pants and a vintage looking white blouse. I don't know how I would wear this blouse, not much to say about this combination, as it is again very simple. My lookbook making skills have become worse, haven't they? Oh my cookie. The black lace top looks great for a dark academia look and combined with these comfortable formal pants I think it's a perfect fit. Again, very casual, but if you're sitting down all day doing studying and reading I'd rather wear sweatpants than the perfect Pinterest dark academia outfits, if I'm really honest with you. Even though I love an aesthetically looking Pinterest board. The next outfit gives me schoolgirl vibes and that's of course what this lookbook is about. The top is secondhand and I thrift flipped it. The skirt I also recently thrifted on a flea market. This outfit is probably my favorite one. I got these brown boots as a present, which makes wearing them feel extra special. I really like the small heel and how they are perfect for the fall season. The top is my romantic blouse that I've been wanting to get rid of for several months and never seem like I can. And the pants are from Ralph Lauren, thrifted and probably vintage. This last outfit consists of a playful white blouse that would fit a fairy or cottagecore lookbook perfectly and my comfy white leg pants. This outfit looks very casual and comfortable and I would definitely wear it with some high heels and a long coat to walk through the streets of an old town. Towards a cute cafe to sit behind the window while reading a book, drinking a cup of coffee and watching people starting to run as rain pours from the sky. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope to see you next time. Bye bye!